Good, uh, good pit stop. Thumbs up. Yeah, doesn't it? Don't worry, soon enough the sights we'll have, we'll have uh, porta potties on them. We'll have to lock them up. Anyway, yeah, so driveway. Oh, excuse me. Obviously, from that exterior wall all the way down, pretty much where the stone is, gravel, stone, whatever you want to call it, all the way right here. That lovely white line. So the first thing we're going to do, take a little bit of this stone. So this area is low. This area is low because that garage floor is high, just as high as that one. You can't just go and then climb back up. That just looks stupid. Anyways, so yeah. We're gonna put a little bit of stone on either side of the fence and then work our way this way. We don't need a whole lot. I think where we need most of it, it's probably right here, Mark. And all that brick there too, we're gonna to end up putting underneath the deck in the back, which is right there. Ooh, I got the odds. Hey. Pitter patter, we're gonna move some stone and get at her. Ooh, water. It looks good. Hero, hero. I haven't recorded much because, well, a lot going on here. I was just picking up the camera and uh, some lady stopped me. She wanted a quote for your driveway. It's, it's a nice thing about coming to these new subdivisions when you have a reputation like we have. People will come up and, uh, yeah, that's all it takes is a quick little conversation and boom. New battery, a freshie, a freshie. You guys are enjoying the break. Digging out the walkway here. That's gonna be dug out too, but we'll do it when we dig this out. Um, same with that little area. You can see the white line is gonna be walkway. All the way over to the driveway. The driveway actually is starting right here. John was edging this all out with the shovel so we can dig it with that little girl because we gotta separate the organics from the sand. That way we can dig here. This little patch is still here because that's a sewer clean out. And right here, water shut off. What are you talking about? I'm not overloaded. We're golden. Golden. All right, speaking of which, I'm going to go uh, dump a load. That sounded weird. I'm going to go dump the dump truck. And uh, yeah, we hear thunder in the distance, so we're. We're going to try to do what we can and uh, get the heck out of here. Bam.
get the trailer hooked up and things over here. That way we don't have to uh, race. Nothing worse than being in a rush all the time. I freaking hate it. Next year is going to be a whole lot different, let me tell you. A whole lot different. No crazy rush. Don't get me wrong, there'll be time for a garage, but it's just not going to be uh, too, too often. Try not to back into the garage here, that's always a bonus. I don't think they would like that very much. Got to be careful, this is exactly where the gas lines cross in the main. I usually do this with the excavator, but... I take my time. Should be fine. Knock on wood. Not that there's any wood to knock on in this machine. I think uh, I think we'll be okay. Cruiser packing her in. Banker's hours. Four 
o'clock. Four o'clock, that's good enough, right? I guess it is probably closer to five, actually. But that would probably make more sense. Surprise, surprise, I bet you that's a bell fiber optic. Oh, surprise! <laughs> it's exactly what it is. You know what, I gotta give them props. They got it three inches deep over here three instead of, oh, instead never of mind, never mind. It's like an inch deep. Jesus. Lovely, lovely. Oh. You know, Bell, whoever you hire to do this crap, fire them. Fire them. They suck. I gotta dig all the way through here. My goodness, I can't do this. Oh, it's under the machine. I bet you the frickin' thing's right there. This is just coming out of the ground now. Wouldn't want to uh, Big little spot of there, eh? I bet you the conduit's right there. Cause it's gonna be coming uh, from the conduit. Here, I'll move this freaking thing. Stupidness. Good thing I decided to back that drag, drag that a little bit. I already had to rip the shit out of that. Pardon my language. We would've had a problem. Really? Why was it so easy to pull? I know. It's almost like I was pulling it out of conduit. Oh my goodness, eh? Fuck, is this doing that exact same Oh! <laughs> That's why. Well, you know what? I got a video evidence that we didn't do that. This was over here. Yeah. We didn't do shit. You know what? We, we, we gotta figure out where the end, end of this is because it was, it was cut. Running about eight inches away from the Bell, you suck. Because yeah, when I hit that with a fucking shell, that's pathetic. No, you didn't, dude. No, if I no. did, though, I'm just pathetic. Yeah, have a look. Have a look. See? It'll probably be right, uh, right there, huh? Yeah, right about there, -ish, I would imagine. Oh, that's, yeah, that's why I usually put this shit a little deeper than uh, an inch, right? I swear I just seen that trench where it was going. Let's see. 
No, it wasn't you, man, because it was further than where you etched it out. It's got a picture of a telephone on it. Huh. Oh, bell sucks. They really do. They seriously suck. Did you find it? Oh, yeah, dude. This is an inch deep. Oh, the shovel it's went through the then. Yeah. Well. This is the same subdivision last year. We had the same thing. Great guy helps over there. That's baloney. Yeah. Bell sucks. That's well, pathetic. let's hope they can fix that because it's going to our client's house. And they got a piece of conduit on that end of it, but they don't have anything hooked up to Bell. But uh, Bell's going to be getting a phone call for sure. They got to do better than that, man. They really do. It's like they just laid sod right on top of the wire. Almost. Well, no, this is Bell, the whatever contractor they hired to run their fiber optic. That was in after the fact. That okay. was put in oh, this yeah. spring, just like every job we've done, dude. Remember the. Yeah. 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 You know what the funny thing is? It was a shovel that did it. No, I know. Not that freaking thing. <laughs> it was a shovel. <laughs> oh well. It is what it is. It's out of the way now. We'll uh, just leave that like so. But yeah, the sod's not even growing. Hey, look at that. It comes right up. There we go. Banging. All right, well, I'm gonna keep on uh, digging. I just pulled the line right out of the way. That's the only thing to do. Same thing with that. All right, so now we're stripping the organics and the rest of the driveway that was once lawn.
provocative, obviously. So, uh, I think I'm going to set you guys up outside. Do a little time lapse, time lapse through here. So we got the dig out excavation done. We're down uh, just over a foot and 14 inches is our mark for this one. We got two clean outs we're going to adjust. We got to get covers for them. The wash, water shut off will have to come up. Uh, we got to clean around these a little bit. And uh, yeah. Deer. What happened there? Looks like a chunk of sod. And we still got to do that little bit of dig out right there, which is not much at all, really, to tell you the truth. And then that little tiny piece. But we'll do that in the morning because I don't have trucks coming here, um, I think, till like 10, 10 in the morning. I get the foot rake out right now. <laughs> That's all you need. Just get the foot rake. Oh my goodness, there's a shut off. Just get the foot rake out and we're golden. So yeah, we'll clean all this up tomorrow morning. Yeah, one load left on the truck, and then I'm going to have one more load coming out. Bell's going to be here to fix this because of the stupid contractor they hired at an inch below ground. And it's funny, the machine didn't hurt it, but the hand shovel did, right over there. Yeah. I love it. All done? For today. Yeah, looks good. Yeah, we'll be back tomorrow. Yeah. yeah I got a little bit of a dig out yet to do up there, and then... Uh, underneath the window and then Bell's got to come here all right so like I said I got the dig out pretty well done we got a few things to do yet uh, gonna line the driveway get the gravel in away we go I'm gonna have to get some more cones here I don't need anyone driving in off here there uh, tonight anyways I'm gonna go dump this uh, last uh, load here Apparently I got a bunch of cucumbers coming out of my vegetable garden and uh, my wife and kids are going to eat it all if I don't go home there soon. I think it's 6.30 so I better go home. I'm going to dump this, I'm going to head on out and then I'm going to drop some cones off here on my way home because I don't live far from here. Anyways, everyone uh, take care. God bless. We'll see you tomorrow.